Ah! I don't know why people constantly want to feel so close to death all the time. Dude, just go out and fight animals in the fucking woods. Is that even legal? What are the... If you go out there and you're looking for a bear to wrestle and you're alone, I don't feel like the bear is gonna call the police because you're trying to wrestle it, dude. All right, I feel like the bear doesn't have that in it. It's probably gonna win, but it's not like it's gonna be like, hey, there's this guy who keeps harassing me and my gang. How do you know, Chad? I live on the East Coast. I know. I also know that yesterday when I went out on the porch while it was raining, because I was like, oh, I'm gonna like, drink my tea out in the like out on the porch i had like a co i have a covered porch and i go out there and all of, I, all of a sudden i hear <coughs> huh hello <coughs> and i look down like about 10 feet away from me is a frog and they're so mad at me they're like shaking they're shaking because they were like on the porch right where my gutter like drops off water because, like, they just wanted to catch some sweet rainwater underneath the waterfall. They were so fucking mad at me, dude. <sniffs> and then you start, and then I'm like, yo, dude, it's cool. This porch is big enough for both of us. Not according to him, because he starts jumping towards me. He starts hopping towards me, like, angrily. And, like, puffing up his frog chest. So I, I roll my eyes. Here we fucking go again. It's like, I got a fenced in goddamn yard, dude. So this frog's sneaking in through like a hole. Maybe negotiate with them. They don't take negotiations. I could tell by the way that frog was approaching me. Any sort of effort to act like you're peaceful, they don't care. The frog continued to approach. 